My name is Kelvin. I'm a photographer with Light Up Pixels Photography. As a wedding photographer, you know, I'm always surrounded by, you know, pretty good food. <laughs> and imagine having that every weekend. About four years ago, um, I had a shoot in Japan and I was weighing 99.7 kg. So then I ate and ate and ate. On the way back on the plane, um, somehow my watch, the class just undid itself. And then I realized that I had difficulty putting it back on because it was just too tight. All those years ago when he first mentioned like, oh, I'm gonna try lose some weight. I didn't really notice it or think much of it until like maybe six months later where I was standing in the lift with him and I realised, hmm, he looks a bit different. He was the one who really emphasised the importance of exercise in our family. He really has like a lot of dedication to his like, gym schedules and, you know, going out on his walks as well. And even if he's busy with a photo shoot or something, he still manages to make the time for exercise. Um, so I've tried like intermittent fasting, I've tried, you know, on a keto diet. They all work to a certain extent, but none of them were sustainable though. So yeah, I mean, it was kind of discouraging. I think eventually what um, enabled me to succeed was just, I think, I think just being tenacious, right? And just not wanting to give up. I basically work out five times a week. Each workout session is about usually an hour to an hour and a half. I kind of make it a non-negotiable as well. So in the past, I used to go early at like 7 a.m. But now I gym at 12 instead, uh, just before I pick up the boys. I kind of realized that, that nutrition is so important, right? So I, I watch that a lot more carefully. I'm eating a lot more fruits than I thought I would. <laughs> so yeah, fruits is one, vegetables definitely, because vegetables keep me full. For dieting, um, I've realized now that, that, that an easy way to do it would be to track it. What I've done is that, you know, I've gone to some of my favorite hawker stores, uh, like the chicken rice store that I really enjoy, and I would tap out the chicken rice bag, and I would basically weigh it at home because I was a bit too embarrassed to bring the weighing scale to the hawker store. <laughs> I think with my kids and all, you know, uh, I do feel like there's just so much processed food all over that's so available to them now. I just feel like, you know, in terms of like um, the nutrition and all, as long as they have less processed food, more wholesome food, you know, that's a very good start. We encourage them to eat healthier and all. You know, it's not always easy, but it's important for us as parents to pass on these healthy habits to our children, the next generation. I think it's really about finding out what works for you and your family. Even if it's the smallest change, by being consistent with our efforts, we'll see it grow into something more sustainable and transforming. Mm -hmm.